Hey guys, it's Mandy. Um, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make one of these little candy stars. Now this is actually the first thing I was taught how to make, and I did not teach myself how to make it, believe it or not. I'm kidding, I'm not that great. Um, a person named a Amber told, or taught me how to make it on Facebook. Um, Ombre or Ombre something, I'm not sure what her username is, but I will p gladly post it as a link, link in the bottom bar. Um, what you will need, there we go, I'm turning my attention to the bottom here. Okay, what you will need is, <laughs> what you will need, um, I don't know if you can see that, is 10 of one color, 10 beads of one color, 15 of another. The first thing you do is take your string, any kind of string that you wish. My preference right now, I'm going to be using non-stretchy string. Um, it's actually fishing line. Um, and what you do is you string on the 10 beads that you want to be, as you can see, the middle, which the middle is the black beads in this case. But the middle, my middle is going to be the solid green beads. And you just string them on. Like so. And they have to be 10. If they're not, you will know it will not turn out even. So there you have your 10 beads. Cut the string off like so. And tie it. Yes, Mom? Sorry, my mom is like right in front of me right now. Say hi, Mom. Making a video. Yeah. Oh, say hi. Hi. Yep. So then you tie your string off. Then you have something that looks like this. And then you take your string again. And you put it through one of the points. You see how the points are like that? Put it through one of the points and thread on three beads. So you have the point beads that you want. And in my case, it's going to be the sparkly beads. Thread on three, and then go every other point. Go from this point to this point to this point, and so on. And you spread them on three at a time. Hence 15, because there are 5 points. 3 times 5 is 15, for those of you who don't know. Which I'm pretty sure my viewers are smart enough to figure out what that means. No. Um, so on and so forth until you're finished. And then you tie it off. And I'll show you how to tie it off. Like I said, um, Amber taught me how to make these, and that's the first thing, the first thing out of candy that I learned how to make besides, you know, singles. Which I already knew how to make singles. I've made bracelets before. Many times before. I just never knew it was called candy. Or it could be called candy. So once you get to this... You cut off your string so you have this, and then you add on your last three beads. And then you just tie it off when you're done. And then you have the star. Um, for time's sakes, actually, no, because it's not really that hard. It's not really that much time to just tie it. So what you have once you cut off your string and make it all pretty is this. Your star. I 
there you go. This is a very quick little video. Um, the next time I'm going to teach you how to make little cubes, and I'll, um, learn how to make those, like, the second time. The things like that, like these, except for bracelets and stuff, this was the first thing like that I, was, I learned how to make. Cubes was the second one, uh, cups were the third one. But yeah, they're fun, they're cute, especially if you mix and match little colors. It's the same exact thing for these. I'll teach you how to make these soon enough. But, but they're really cute. So I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, and I will see you guys back here in this very spot in my room. No, probably not this very spot in my room, but I will see you guys back here in a few days. Because I'm going to make another tutorial for you. And it might have something to do with, not with candy this time. I gotta go because my mom's giving me the stink stare. It goes like this. Legit. Like that. <laughs> not like this. <laughs> I love you. I gotta go though, guys. I hope you enjoy this tutorial and have fun making your candy stars and stuff. Peace, love, unity, respect. Bye!